<laughs> Hello and welcome to another Movie Magic Budgeting Tips and Tricks. I'm your host Stephen Kinchelik, and in this video I'll be showing you a new warning system that we've built into Movie Magic Budgeting 7. It shows you when there's data in columns that might be hidden from view. Let me show you how that works. So here I am in a detailed account of my budget. And just to show you as an example, I've exposed all the hidden columns that you can have in your detail account. So that includes the unit 2, unit 3, unit 4, and rate 4 uh, columns that can be hidden. And I can hide those by right-clicking anywhere in the header and selecting which ones I want to have hidden. Another way of doing that, and probably an easier way, is going up to Setup, Budget Preferences. And over here in the lower, lower right-hand corner, I can uncheck the, the columns that I want to have hidden or check the ones that I want to have seen. Now, I will just click OK, and you'll see that what we've added is a thick black line showing you that there's hidden columns there. Now, if I right-click here and select second unit to show that one, uh, the unit 2 column is just an additional unit field that you can put uh, information into, but it's also a field that you can put, let's say, a percentage into. And when I do that, Notice it's calculating 2% of $10,000, which is equaling $200. And if I hide this second unit column, I wouldn't necessarily know that that calculation is happening. And so what we've added is, if there's information in that column, we've turned that section red to show you that there's data hidden in that column that's affecting the calculation. So if you had sent this budget to another person and they didn't know that there was a percentage in that hidden column, they may say, you know, hey, this isn't calculating correctly. Uh, but now you can go in and see, oh, there's a percentage there. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that or keep it. And now it's calculating as they would expect. And I'm going to go ahead and hide that column again. Now, notice that in version 6, these thick black lines weren't there. So this is a good tip for people who are using version 6 that uh, if your calculations aren't looking correct you may want to check and see those extra columns and see if there's any data in there that's affecting the calculation. So we hope that will bring more visibility to how your budget calculates but if there's other areas where we can bring more visibility we'd love to hear about them. Send that feedback to budgetingbeta at entertainmentpartners.com also be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can get updates on when we add new videos Another way to get updates is to follow our Twitter account, twitter.com slash movie underscore magic. Also be sure to check our website, entertainmentpartners.com, to get all the latest updates on all our new products and services. Thanks for watching.